Happy day, friends. We are starting the day off going to the aquarium today. We're gonna go see some fishies. We're and here before pages. the place even opens. <laughs> yeah, we got here so early, you guys. We were pulling up and I was like, oh, I didn't even check to see like what time it was. Thankfully, we were running late and we got here at 10, but we were planning on coming here around 9.30ish, so, so it's a good thing that we were late today. It is not very common that we just interject a video with an announcement or something like that, but this is kind of time sensitive, so we wanted to make sure you guys knew as soon as possible that if you wanted one of these blush hoodies from Happy Day Apparel, we got a lot of requests. We sold out within two days and a lot of you guys still wanted one so we decided we are going to restock them but we are going to do a pre-order that way you guys get exactly what you want we ran out of everything in the blush hoodie it was super popular it's the the terry cloth so it's a really nice fabric it's a really nice fit i am wearing the small i am 5'2 about 130 pounds um but if you want to guarantee that you get your size, that you get one in general, we are opening the pre-order now. It will be open about three to four days, I believe, and then we are going to place our order. So if you want it guaranteed, head over to happydayapparel.com and you can place a pre-order. And it will take roughly two and a half to three weeks to ship out. So that's the turnaround time, not too long of a wait. If you guys want a guarantee that you get one of these, it's got the happy day embroidery, it's super cute. Um, go on over and you can place your pre-order now. What is that guy, Micah? A tall guy, that's right. A little kid just walked by pointing at it. <laughs> and his mom was like, yeah, is that scary? And Micah looks over and like after they start walking away, no, he's friendly. <laughs> she has loved this thing ever since she was about Paige's age. What do you think of that guy? Guy, tall guy. Big tall guy. We call him big tall guy. I don't know what else to call him. Anyways, um, being at the mall right when it opens, it's nice because there's like nobody here. It's pretty fantastic. And also kind of delaying because there's a field trip happening. Yeah, there was a field trip I think that, that went over to the aquarium we were going to. So we're gonna walk around a little bit. I might stop and get some of my favorite bath bombs. Let's go look at Pac Sun. Okay, let's go look at Pac Sun real quick. <laughs> Pac Sun is straight up like the worst styles of my childhood. <laughs> Just kidding, like it's honestly, some of the things are honestly growing on me and it feels so weird to say that because for a long time I was like no like I'll never I'll never start to like that again but certain parts of it are growing on me well, just now it's not nostalgic not the bucket hats that's for sure definitely not a hat person certainly oh, no, not I a feel bucket like we could hat person. Some uh, maybe we could but I wouldn't like it but then in 5 years we'd look back and be like that was a terrible like why why did we See, do that again? This is the best part about having this be the new trend is we know what's gonna look bad in five years. That's like, true, <laughs> that's true, is we're already experienced. We've been through it, we know it's gonna be like, ugh. No, don't wear those mom <laughs> jeans. Please don't wear those mom jeans. You're gonna hate them in five years. Is he being silly? Yeah. What's he doing? He's eating. Is he eating? <laughs> do you have a come name on, for him? Come on, over here. Oh, where, what's over there? Whoa, he ate it, he came and got it. They're having some good seaweed snacks. Yeah. Oh, is it only one piece? It was literally two tiny pieces of Oh, seaweed. well, you can crumple it up. <laughs> oh, Instead I didn't of, consider that. Yeah, he he had a full up. snack. He had a whole big piece. Hey, are you having fun? Yeah, she is. She got out of the house today. Oh, he's moving. He's moving. Yeah. The armadillo is awake. That's wild. I just want him to boom, 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 roll off the thing. All right. Oh, you want to see the birdies? The chickens. Silly chicken time. What's over here? What is it? Oh, it's a little lizard in there. A gecko. Another one. A big guy. Look at this big turtle. Right there. Wow. Wow. Whoa, look at the turtle. It looks like a big rock. That looks like a big, big rock. Should we call him Mr. Turtle? Or Myrtle? 
Or Myrtle. Myrtle's a girl. Myrtle the turtle. You know it's a good turtle name. <laughs> Look, you can pat him. Oh, just kidding. Really nice. What does that feel like? Is he soft? Is he, is he kind of bumpy? You gotta pet it real lightly, huh? Oh, good wow. job. Very nice. Can I see his eyes? Kind of He's bumpy. looking at you. Yeah, bumpy. You want to touch? Very light. Very light. <laughs> Like maybe just like. <laughs> Good job. Good job. Good job, Micah. Wait. She didn't like it. She likes it for like one second, and then she's like, "Ew, gross." <laughs> Where is it? Yeah, baby. Can you say blue fishy? Say blue. Fish. Yeah, good job. You love the fish, huh? What do you want to show me, dude? Right there. Where? Right there, right there, right there, right there. Whoa. Right there. Wow. Wow. Hey, Micah. Cool, huh? Micah, can you show me where the yellow fish is? There's an escapee in the building. He escaped. There he goes. There he goes. Grateful that they are taking naps at the same time more often than normal. I think Paige is eventually gonna switch to that one nap a day. Seems like that's the trend. Um, but Austin and I are, we have some time to do like a planning session. We don't have our lives organized enough to have regular planning sessions. So it's like scattered here and there and everywhere. But we're gonna actually sit down and like do some work together, plan some things, try to get ourselves a little organized. And it is absolutely beautiful outside. Like if I could work out here all the time, oh, wonderful. But oftentimes we're both stuck sitting at a computer screen inside. We do have a tablet, which Austin could, you could, you could bring the tablet out and answer emails though, babe. Yeah. Don't, don't forget about that every so often, yeah. especially now that it's so nice out. Cheers, planning date. Love Cheers. you. Love you. You're not the greatest work partner. Hey, <laughs> you need to drink. You can't cheers. Oh, whoops. Drink. Just kidding. You're the greatest. That's a bad omen. You're the greatest. Thanks. I love you. Love you too. Can we go back inside? This is the month for the uh, the training of the Independence Day celebration. Yeah, so they do an air show. Yeah, they're training for the air show. Generally, it would be a great, beautiful day to work, but it is loud right now, like to the point where we legit cover our ears because it is loud. Okay, on with our meeting. <laughs> I found a kitty cat. Look, you got kitty ears. Meow. Meow, meow, meow. She keeps wanting me to hold her. I think uh, her foot fell asleep while she was sleeping, and so she doesn't want to walk on it quite yet. Is it all better yet, though? Because you are, you are getting a little heavy. Mom's not, mom's not strong enough. I have to work on getting stronger. Oh, right there. Yeah. Is it like a little boo boo? Yeah. Oh, by the way, guys. Uh, so I showed you the whole tattoo prank thing that I pulled on Austin. It's in the last video. But the following morning, I woke up and look at how dark it had turned. Look how dark that is. It was like bam, overnight. And then I also woke up with this on my finger. It's faded since, but no idea how that came to be. I didn't notice it until yesterday morning. And then this one, this one is already starting to fade big time, but, yeah. but they all just got darker overnight for some reason. Thank you, you're sharing your bracelets with me? That's really nice. 
Okay, you put them on me, please. Here, this this hand. Thank you. Do we look alike, you guys? Do you think we look alike, Micah? No. Yes? Is that a yes? Do we look like we could be twins? No. Oh, no? No way? Some people think that Micah is a spitting image of Austin, and other people think no. me. Is this what a kitty likes to do? Just cuddle and relax, and then out of nowhere, swipe you in the face. Saki was a scary kitty. Oh, do you want to tell them about Saki? Okay, listen to this story, you guys. This happened when we were in Hawaii. And when I say this happened, I mean, nobody really knows. <laughs> okay, tell them what happened. The kitty cat. What did he do? Scratched me. Scratched you? So maybe we should preface by saying Saki is a really mean cat, right? Yeah, but... Johnny was a nice kitty cat. <laughs> yes, and Johnny is a nice kitty cat. And what color is Johnny? Which is white. Yes, and what color is Saki? Black and white. Yes, black and white. All your facts are are true. They're all true. And so when Saki, what happened? What did, so what did Saki do? He did that to you? Did he say anything? Did he hiss at you? No, he just out of nowhere scratched you? It totally sounds like something Saki would do, huh? Like, I'm telling you guys, this is a mean cat. He's a really mean cat. So much that they have to warn people when you walk into their house. And so, Micah says that Saki scratched you on the arm, huh? And then what did Grandma Rachel do? Gets. Saki away. He, she got Saki away? What did she tell him? Go, Saki. Go upstairs. Go upstairs, Saki. Yeah. And and at one point, my mom did, like, shoo Saki upstairs. Um, it's the whole scratch thing that nobody knows about except Micah. I'm glad that you're okay, though, huh? I'm glad that it wasn't anything worse. Love you so much. Meow. What's wrong, Meow Meow? meow. Oh, you don't want me to pat you. I got you. I get it. I understand. Very true to kitty form. Yes, very much so. Are you doing the creep? What is that called? Or are you being a kangaroo? Get you your legs tell. all flexing in your arms to you, Rex, and do the creep. Do the creep. <laughs> <laughs> hey, Micah, we have a surprise for you. What surprise? I have, we, Daddy went to the store and got you a surprise. Okay. Do you like surprises? Yes. What kind of surprises do you like? What is it? <laughs> well, what is it? we'll show you. We'll show you what it is. But you have to work hard and help Dad put it together, okay? And then you can enjoy your surprise. Do you want to help me put together your surprise? Yeah. Okay. Sweet. Let's go look at it. We need to get your shoes on. Austin just got back. Uh, We got her a... Don't listen. Go ahead, you can go downstairs and get your shoes on. We got her a trampoline. And uh, Austin was like, what do we do? Like, should I put it together and then surprise her? But then he was saying, well, when we got our grill, I loved when she helped me put it together. It was like such a fun, cute memory for him. And, and so I was just like, have her help you with it. It'll teach her hard work. You'll get the fun time spent with her, like working with tools, and she's just really, really cute trying to mimic him with the tools and help, and it's, it's just adorable. So I feel like we'll show her the box, and they can put it together, and it will be a good experience for everybody. She'll get the surprise, she'll work hard for it, they get that bond. Oh, you put your shoes on real fast. You must be ready. Oh, I think, are they on the wrong feet or the right feet? The right feet. They're on the right feet? Yeah. Hmm. Looks like they're a little backwards. What do you think your surprise is gonna be? Kristoff. You think it's Kristoff? Oh, wow. What else do you think it might be? Sven. You think Kristoff and Sven are your surprise? Hey, babe. Yeah? She thinks it's Kristoff and Sven. It's better than Kristoff and Sven. <gasps> what could be better than Kristoff and Sven? <laughs> 
Think real hard. What do you think it is? Don't get too let down. <laughs> I want no, you to get pumped, but I don't want you to get let down. All right, let's go see. Okay, you ready to go see? Should let's we put your shoes on the right feet? It's okay. Oh, okay, yeah. Here. Let's do it. We'll hurry and do that. I don't think you've ever gotten ready to do something this quick in your life. <laughs> I should have had you clean the floor before we went into this. <laughs> clean up all your toys. Okay, Dad's ready. Dad's ready. Okay. Do you see it? Do you know what it is? It's a trip. It's a, a trip. trip. Are and you? It's all yours. Are you excited? Yes. Do you we want to help me put it together so we can jump? Yes. All right. Let's get to it. Pound it. Boom. <laughs> I think Daddy's finally Am done. Am I finally done? Yeah. Am I done? Are you excited? <laughs> oh wait, what about this, Dad? Do we have to tie these down? Yeah, I need to tie them down, okay. but I can do that while she jumps. Wow! Are you so excited? <laughs> Woo! <laughs> <laughs> oh, Paige, what are you doing? Okay, here, are you like, fixing oh, a bike? she's fixing her trike. Are you fixing the trike with the tool? Fix it! <laughs> Good Ooh. job, Paige. Fix your tricycle. Oh my gosh. Whoo, that was so much more work than I anticipated. Those safety nets are ridiculous. Yeah, no kidding. That's got some bounce to it. Yeah, it does. I was in there and I was like, holy dang, this is pretty dang bouncy. Pretty bouncy. Can you tell Dad thank you so much for putting it together? Thank you. You're very welcome, sweet pea. <laughs> this is more so a present for mom and dad than it is for you. No kidding. You guys gave us a lot of Ugh. Ah. Ah. Paige can go in a, in a little bit after we tie it all together. You guys gave us a lot of input and thank you for that, but we ultimately decided on a little trampoline. The price point was great. Um, we knew that it would last them. Oh, Paige, don't put that in your mouth. We really wanted something that they could play with on their own. No help from us. I don't want to have to be supervising them if they're climbing up like a rock wall on a playground or something like that. Or I don't want to have to be constantly, oh mom, push me, push me on the swing, push me on the swing. Like I didn't want that constantly. Like this is something that Austin and I, <laughs> as selfish as it may sound, we wanted something that was hands free for us. And I think this was a good choice. Is this a happy day? No. Maybe. What? <laughs> What? You mean to tell me that we did all this for you and it's not even a happy day? I think you're tricking me. It is a happy day. Oh, I'm right. It is a happy day. Yeah. <gasps> it's daytime. You're like a little kangaroo. Pop, pop, pop. 
Up, pop, pop. She absolutely loves it, you guys. She loves it so much. Hopefully she will just pass out tonight. Just Paint. made a really good point that Micah and I can come sleep out here on the trail. Yeah, like a little big fort. Put yeah. a blanket over it. It's All instantly bug proof. It. It'd be dope. Yeah. Oh. Are you excited now? She, well, that too, but when she finally can have like her first sleepover. Oh, yeah. Not that we would allow her out here for her first sleepover, but. Yeah, that would be, that would be, that would be pretty crazy. Maybe if you slept out here with them. Yeah. Austin was just saying, like, well, we were going to clean out the garage tonight, but now, now we're not so sure because <laughs> that, that took exhausting. a bit longer than he expected. But now everybody is happy. <laughs>